Not at all. The phrase that consists of three basic English words is forever in the center of never-ending controversy. How is it pronounced? First, very importantly, we need to be clear with one thing: which accent are we talking about? This phrase is pronounced very differently in different countries, but still, none of it sounds like these Chinese characters. Nao Tai Tao. I want to take a moment to talk about the public ridicule of Nao Tai Tao. Not at all. It's not an easy phrase to pronounce. It contains many tricky sounds for Chinese speakers. Training your body to make brand new sounds is hard. You know it. You've been there. There's nothing wrong with borrowing sounds from your mother tongue to assist your learning when you explore a foreign language. No one should be laughed at and bullied for their choices of pronunciation when they speak English, Chinese, or any other language. It's a simple matter of one's learning resources and personal preference. We need to be respectful. You may have heard that if people say thank you, you could respond not at all as a way to say you're welcome. That's not really the case in America. I think it may work in other countries, but Americans don't usually say that. As a reply to "thank you," you may hear Americans say, "No problem, no worries, my pleasure, don't worry about it, don't mention it, forget about it." If someone tells you "thank you," you must have gone through a lot of trouble. Then, "not at all" would be a natural response, as you're implying, "No, it's no trouble at all." But most of the time, Americans only say "not at all" as another way, a stronger way to say "no." Did you hear what I said? Not at all. I'm sorry. Are you tired? Not at all. Would you mind if I open the window? Not at all. Please. I'd like some fresh air too. Now, pronunciation. Let's take a look at these Chinese words. Nao, Tai, Tao. Notice the two T sounds in Tai. And tao, the most noticeable difference between British and American accents with this phrase is that you can hear the second t sound in the British accent, but you will not hear it in the American accent. The letter t in the word at in the middle of the phrase is pronounced as a stop t in America, meaning you still move your tongue and muscles to make the t sound, but you do not release the air in the end. So, in the American accent, is not going to be similar to "tao" this sound. The end result is "tao" and not "tao." The first word is "not." American people usually pronounce "not." The end result is "not." The end result is "not." The end result is "not." At 的影响，这个 t 会变成美式口音里常出现的 flap t， 类似于 water 里的 t。我曾经详细的说过 water 这个词的发音。如果你需要温习一下的话呢，可以点开这个链接。另外呢 ，at 这个词也会弱化，从 at 弱化成 a， 注意结尾是 stop t，a not at。连在一起的感觉呢，就变成了这样 ，not it, not it。结尾的 all, not at all, not at all, not at all。英式发音呢和美式有很明显的不同，两个 t 呢都还是 t， 所以结尾呢能够发出这样的音 ，tall, not at all, not at all。希望这个视频对你有帮助，非常感谢你的点赞、转发、收藏，别忘了加关注，下次再见。<音乐>